Hello, and thanks for tuning in. In this review, I'm going to be taking a look at director Paul W.S. Anderson's unsung masterpiece. And now, Event Horizon. The movie is about a rescue crew investigating a spaceship that was thought to be lost in a black hole years before. As this is a horror film, you can expect that things quickly go wrong. The filmmakers were heavily inspired by Alien, The Shining, and Hellraiser. And as such, you can expect a lot of the familiar elements of those films to be present here. The movie maintains an effectively creepy tone throughout, and doesn't rely on cheap jump scares like modern horror. There's also some surprisingly strong cinematography. The film is incredibly well shot, and has some striking imagery. The acting in the film is competent, which should come as no surprise when you consider there are two Oscar nominees in the cast, in Lawrence Fishburne and Kathleen Quinlan, as well as the ever-brilliant Sam Neill. There are a number of surprisingly well-done practical gore effects in the film, but it's not an outright gore fest. It should be noted, however, that the film was heavily censored with over 30 minutes of footage cut. I feel this could have worked in Anderson's favor, however, as the film's pacing is incredibly tight. There is some really dated CGI, and there's just no getting around it. It looks horrible. It should also be noted that the film's opening and ending credits are a complete waste of time, and I advise you to just fast forward through them or shut them off when they come up. In closing, Event Horizon is an above-average science fiction horror thriller that comes to a satisfying conclusion. If you're a fan of either genre, you should give it a shot, and if you've already seen it, you should pay it a revisit, as it holds up incredibly well.